what's going on? Welcome back to the channel today. Now, a little bit of a different video. It's absolutely boiling outside, so my window shut. I'm going to open up real quick right now. But I've uh, been a fair few people shouting out in the street and stuff right now, so it's not exactly ideal for making videos when you've got people shouting and just in general being like, Bleh. and there it is. So I'm just going to shut the window again and die. But, um,. Yeah, uh, so it's absolutely boiling again today. I think the news said we were actually meant to get about like 28, 29 degree weather here in Glasgow. I can't remember quite what they said it was. But uh, yeah, it's hot at the end of the day either way. Um, and yesterday in my video, I want I mentioned uh, their souls for gold. The top I'm wearing, I'm wearing it again today because uh, it's clean still and I love this top and it's just so comfortable, especially in the heat because it's like mainly white which reflects heat, get the, the bug away from me. So yeah, me being smart and science they're wearing white, also one of my favorite tops. But um, yeah, I mentioned them in the video yesterday, they actually noticed it, tweeted me out on Twitter. So uh, yeah, as I said, I know a couple of the guys in the band, they're all really good mates, and obviously one of them's my sister's boyfriend as well. So do me a favor guys, will you? Uh, anyone that, Obviously, doesn't watch this that knows them. So, Amy, Dan, and anyone else that watches that doesn't already know them, go check them out. I'll put their Twitter, their website, their Bandcamp and SoundCloud. I think they've got. I think it's Bandcamp and SoundCloud, but their Twitter, Bandcamp, SoundCloud, website, everything will be down in the description below. Make sure you go check them out. Uh, they've actually got a gig the 15th of August because it's the same day as my induction and that sorts the problem from yesterday as well. Friday the 15th of August they've actually got a gig at the O2 Academy in Birmingham. So if you live in Birmingham make sure you go along check that out. It will be an awesome night, I know it. Uh, they are absolutely amazing, awesome music, awesome and general vibe to the gigs and they're just pretty cool guys. So. If you're in Birmingham and you like the kind of music, make sure you go check them out, O2 Academy, Friday, 15th of August. As I said, I'll put everything down in the description below so you can go check them out as well. Now, this is not a promotional video for the Souls for Gold, I just thought, you know, they tweeted me, they got the video a little bit of exposure, I'm going to do something for them, you know, I scratch your back, you scratch mine. Although, technically, they scratched my back first, so I'm repaying them. But uh, yeah, so they gave the video a little bit of exposure, just thought, you know what, I'll do the same, let you all know about the Twitter, the SoundCloud, etc. But uh, yeah, so make sure you go check them out guys, please, huge favour from me, really, really appreciate it. But uh, moving on, you'll see at the start of the video today a new intro, and at the end you're going to see a new outro as well, just let me know what you guys think of them. Uh, I'm not going to sit here and take credit and say I'd done them, they were templates that were made, I have put the channel and the featured channels in my homepage so if you go to the homepage of my channel uh, look at my featured channels as you'll see there's the bottom channel on there right now um, like in return for using the intros and outros and stuff like it's a, f it's a download file I took it in the After Effects I edited it to suit my channel but um, in return all they ask is that you put them in the description or in your featured channels I thought you know what I'll put them in my featured channels that way pretty much anyone that comes to my channel will get to see them, hopefully go find them. So if you're on YouTube and you need an intro and an outro, make sure you go check out the channel as well, it's pretty awesome. Uh, they do a they've got a really, really good selection of templates and stuff. Uh, I couldn't quite think of the word I wanted, so stuff will fill in quite nicely for now. But um, yeah, it's got a really good selection of templates, outros, intros, uh, and he's also got work he's done for clients and stuff as well. He does do custom, custom uh, videos. You do need to pay for them though, they're not free, but uh, if you're good at something, why do it for free, right? Uh, plus he's at that point where he's done plenty. Everyone knows the quality of them. They're high quality, they're really good. Um, so to be honest, you should be paying for them anyway. I fortunately got one of the download ones that he's offering, so yeah. Uh, if you just want a generic kind of intro and outro one, sorry, my eyes are absolutely killing me right now. My eyes keep shutting. But um, yeah, if you want one of the generic kind of ones, then make sure to check out the templates he's got. If you want a custom one, then go on the channel. I'm pretty sure in the newer videos he's got uh, information in the description. So just click on any one of these videos, look in the description. Information should be there. 
I should, I say. But uh, yeah, uh, what else have I had going on? I have started work on a new project for filming with uh, Chris Shearitz at my college. Uh, Chris Shearitz Media, his channel will be down in the description below as well. He's working on some awesome stuff. Go check him out as well. But yeah, I'm not going to reach that because it's too far away and my chair's too squeaky. Fuck it. I'm reaching it. Uh, but yeah, I've just started work on some new stuff. And well, me being a comic book nerd and a kind of superhero geek as I am, uh, you might have found out from a Geekaboo video. You know, kind of went to the opening, done a bit of promo for them. Uh, that's my Mac and Media channel. Shameless plug. Go check it out. But uh, yeah, so you may have seen in that I'm like quite into my comics and my superheroes and that sort of thing. So, two of my favourite superpowers for movement, uh, especially teleportation and super speed. Now, something that popped out of my head, which of those two, those two would win in a fight? scenario. Now we know from point A to point B, teleportation. Uh, te teleportation, it's got a lot of different limitations on it. Uh, for example, in Jumper, uh, if any of you have seen that, it's the film Hayden Christensen, I think is his name. The guy that played Anakin Skywalker. Uh, he had to have seen the place or been to the place to be able to jump there, as it was, the way he described, they put it. Uh, and X-Men, Nightcrawler, I'm not too sure about the limitations in his ones to be quite honest with you. Uh, X-Men is something that I didn't really watch a lot when I was younger or read a lot. Uh, didn't stop me from watching Days of Future Past though, that was awesome. No question about it, that was awesome. But uh, yeah, so teleportation versus super speed, different limitations, different things. Uh, teleportation is obviously instant, super speed, depending on the distance, it can be instant, it can be up to a couple of minutes or hours depending on how many hundreds or thousands of miles it is. But, um, yeah, so I just thought it would be interesting in a fight scenario what kind of thing would happen. Not gonna give it away, not giving it away yet. But let's just say two people, same age, one born, one born with teleportation, one with super speed, uh, and let's just say they kind of have to rely off the other superpower in order to survive. Uh, you can make of that what you will, but I'm not giving anything away until we have started shooting and brought it out. It's something that me and Chris both want to work on. We both really, really want to do it. I'm going to be talking it over with Chris on our induction on the 15th of August. Till then, I'm obviously going to be going back and forth with him a bit on Facebook and stuff. Uh, just kind of sketching it out, but I'm getting all the notes down, kind of getting the sketches out, and we're going to talk about it a bit more when we go for a pint after an induction in August. So, uh, yeah. Now, as I said, new outro at the end of the video as well, guys. That's just coming up now. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.